Hey, so Hezekiah and I are here in our mud room. We're getting ready to do a big project in here. We're trying to figure out how to sort and organize and make some big changes, yeah? So that we can um, just be more efficient and Hi. not have so much craziness in here all the time. We've done a lot of sorting and organizing in our house and getting rid of stuff that we don't use or want. And now um, we're moving on to the mud room. It's a big project. So I will show you what we've got now and then I will um, keep you updated as we make our changes. So this is our mud room. You walk in, see the front door, well, the back door here, and we've got our big wash sink. We've got some stuff hung up. We do have a um, shelf up there that we use some. And this is where currently all of the boots go. And this is just boots. Now keep in mind, we have a lot of people here. So we have a lot of boots. And we live on a farm, so we use our boots and they need to be easily accessible. So that has been, you know, one of my frustrations. And then you come on through and that leads out into the dining room. But then we have our closet over here. And this is just, oh my goodness, it's just such a mess. So we have all these shelves over here and we currently have a lot of our um, tools, screwdrivers and drills and all of the stuff that we use on a regular basis that we want to have close at hand so that we can, um, you know, just have them be easily accessible, quick to grab when we need them. You can see this is the real deal, guys. This is our super messy, nasty mudroom closet. And then over here on the other side of that closet, we have some more shelves up there and we have um, the girls' dresses. These are their current size dresses. So we have two girls. Um, and they both keep their current size dresses here. The rest of the dresses are hung up in a different closet. We only bring out what we're actually using at the moment. <clears throat> so then we go over here and this is our, all these shelves over here, this is our family closet. And we'll do, I'll do another post about our family closet to explain kind of how we do that. But we do keep all of our kids clothes all together, all sizes, everybody, um, it's all, kept together and that's what is happening over here and then we have our bench and we have these bins at the bottom and each bin you can see how gross and dirty they are but um, each bin has the shoes for one of our kids and the littler ones um, our youngest twins and our two-year-old they all share a bin because they're all very close in size and their shoes are much smaller so they can all share a bin. And our littlest one doesn't really wear shoes yet. He only has one pair of shoes that I keep in my room um, with his clothes. So we have all of that. Come over here, freezer. We have some shelves where we store our egg cartons because we have chickens and we get lots and lots of fresh eggs that we use. We have another freezer and then goes back into our laundry area. So I'll just give you a quick sneak peek, even though it's super dirty right now, of our um, family closet area, which is a little bit crazy at the moment. So our goal is to create a more efficient space where I can keep all of our shoes, uh, but they're not you know, out in the middle of everything. And we want a place to be able to hang up coats quickly and easily so everybody knows where their coat is. We can just grab and go when it's time to go and do something. Um, but also, I don't like how our tools and things are organized right now. I want to um, put up some pegboard back there and take out those shelves so that I can hang up all the different tools and all the different things that we need so they're easy to see and easy to be able to grab. The way that we have it now, all in the baskets and all that stuff, um, it just gets really confusing as to where things actually are and things just kind of get shoved back in and they get put in the back of the shelf and you can't find them and um, it can be really frustrating. So <clears throat> I just want to make it a little bit more visually appealing and nice and I just want to make it easy to find things so that we don't have to, you know, I don't know, hunt for an hour just to find a quick screwdriver. So that is our plan. I'm going to take out shelves and I'm going to um, 
put in the pegboard. I want to put in some shelving for our shoes and our boots. And then eventually, say hi, Kaya. Say hi. Eventually, I would like to make um, kind of a, um, a hall bench type of thing to go over. Oh, wait, there we go. Sorry. To go over here behind me so that we can keep our, we can sit there and do our shoes and our coats and everything, but it's really easily accessible. Um, and it looks a little bit nicer and kind of covers up, you know, the rest of the shelves behind there. So that is our plan and we'll keep you updated. It's going to be fun.